let me ask you guys, what's worth more, an unblemished record or no contest controversy? In this day and age, I want you to tell me what's worth more, undefeated, unblemished record or no contest controversy. You tell me. That's the facts Friday and the black damn two sugars. And I ain't even drinking coffee because I got an upset stomach. Huh? 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 Right now, Terrence Crawford is the most relevant he's ever been. I looked around YouTube. I looked around Twitter. I looked around Instagram. I looked around everywhere. I noticed Terrence Crawford is being spoken about now more than ever since he went live for that Instagram when he was talking about what happened with the contract. This guy cannot get off the lips of boxing me. John J. Doe, correct. Everybody talk about Terrence Crawford being boring. He can't sell out a shoebox and all that shit. <laughs> now, now, we can't stop talking about Terrence Crawford, me included. I tell you guys all the time, bad breath is better than not breathing at all. What's worth more, an unblemished, undefeated record or no contest controversy? This man was undisputed, undefeated, knocked out every welterweight and was seen as not just the B side, he was seen as the C side. People talking about 80 20, 70 30, stuff like that. Bob Aram, Bob Aram saying I lose money with Terrence Bud Crawford. This is exactly what he needed. Can we agree that Terrence Crawford is winning with this conspiracy? Okay. Errol Spence got into a car accident. It's almost like car accidents is getting old for Errol Spence. It was a little moment. A 14-year-old crashed to him, crashed into him, running a red light after stealing his stealing someone's car. And that has fizzled out. His t-shirt fizzled out. Terrence Crawford is on everyone's lips. So, he has proven relevance because of that. And the $10 million that I'm not sure if he received all this money. I'm, I'm hearing weird shit. But the $10 million he was guaranteed, guaranteed $10 million. It's not on It's not on Errol Spence to say, did it hit your bank account or not? With him getting that $10 million and with him being so relevant right now, he has real, tangible, firm grounds to stand on to demand more for that Errol Spence fight. I'm not sure we happy about that because we want the fight to happen now with no issues, but now Terrence Crawford has grounds to demand for more. Yes, I don't give a damn what y'all say.